All right, welcome everyone. My name is Miles from Donovan Watches, and today this video is showing you how to remove links from a stainless steel watch strap. So if you ordered a watch that included this watch strap, or if you just ordered this watch strap directly from DonovanWatches.com, your order would have included a complimentary link removal tool. Um, so the first step is to take this tool and remove you know, unscrew the silver piece and detach it from the black piece here. Next, you wanna take one of the pins that came with the tool. There was three of them. Uh, they're all the same size, so it doesn't matter which one. But just take one of them and screw it into the end of the uh, larger silver piece so that they're attached like this. Then you want to feed it back through the black component to the tool, just like that, okay? Now, the stainless steel watch straps, you'll notice that some of the links have an arrow here on the end of them, on the other side as well. Those are the links that are able to be removed. The arrows indicate which direction you want to push the pin out. So these are all held together by each of these is held together by a pin. So you always wanna push the pin out in the direction that the arrow is pointing. Or when you're putting a pin in, you still wanna follow the direction of the arrow come in this side. Um, so let's just assume for purposes of this video that we want to uh, remove one link from either side. So we would take, take our strap here, grab our tool, Place it right into our tool, just like this. Doesn't matter which one if we're just removing one link. Um, and we want to sort of line up the hole. See the hole there at the end of the uh, link? What we're going to do is we're going to screw this in, and this pin is going to push, this pin is going to go into that hole and push the pin out the other side. So we're going to line up the pin with that hole and screw it until we're, we're in that hole. Now the pin is gonna be pushed out the other side. So we want to look down um, in this little gap of the black piece and you can see where that, the end of that pin is. So you wanna make sure you can see that so this doesn't hit anything when we're pushing it out. Um, so once you got it all lined up, you just screw, keep screwing and you see the pin over here pop out the other side. So then you can unscrew the, the silver piece here and um, once the pin is here, it just comes out nicely. All right, and then you're detached. So the next step is to do the same exact thing um, right here so that we'll fully remove this link here. So we'll put it again right into our tool. We will line up the hole. Oops, there we go. Um, look down this side, make sure we can see the hole. Screw this in, you can see the link coming out the other side. All right, then we release this. Again, we pull this right out. Okay, so now we've removed our link here. We can put that aside. We have our two two pieces here. So we're gonna put them right back together. Make sure the arrows are on the same side and it'll fit together perfectly. And then we just wanna take one of those pins that we just removed. And we wanna put it right back in. So right back in the hole here. Oops, this one. Now you can sort of normally push it in with your finger to about right there. It doesn't go quite all the way in. So what I like to do is to take the um, tool and kind of 
make sure those, you know, touch the two tips of the two pins and you can kind of push it, push it in that way. That last little bit. Make sure it's flush with the side. And there you go. Now your strap is one link shorter.